What are you doing tonight? What are you doing tonight? Tonight's spelled T-O-N-I-T-E. We got a live one, people. I want this lady dangling from a line by her fingernail in less than a minute. Not a minute 10, not a minute 20, and sure as sugar, not a minute 45. What you got? Gwyneth Sanders, age 20, about a page of favorite movies and music, no favorite books. Most recent uploads appear to be photos of vegan meals. Vintage filters? I'm afraid so, sir. Hipsters. All right, think quirky, people. Unless, uh, dating Corey over here is somehow ironic. All right, listen up. This girl's probably used to something a little more exciting than this steamed carrot over here. You're a carrot, Corey. She wants something a little more spicy. It's our job to spice things up. How many peppers? Four peppers. No more, no less. What else can you give me? I'm looking at a possible celebrity crush on Mr. Peanut. I can work with that. Start looking for an emoticon with the top hat. Yeah, or uh, the thing he wears, a half a pair of glasses. What's it called? The uh, monocle. Don't get sloppy. Well, God damn it, I want some rutabaga. How about I just text back something simple like, not much you. Not much, comma, you. Not much, comma, you, question mark. Please tell me it's a single character you. This is not a prepaid drug deal. You're trying to woo a woman. How about getting frozen yogurt, throwing caution to the wind? I got it. All right, OK, look. I'm grabbing for some Froyo. Caution to the wind, right? And we're asking her how she's doing. Punctuation. No question mark. You just gave me chills. Sent. Not sure, laying low. Damn it, we're losing her. We gotta turn the good ship us around, okay? Research, tell me you got something. Dead end. Everything's rice and beans. With all due respect, sir, I can't make something out of nothing. Come on, country bears, we don't have time for this. Damn it, where did you meet this girl? I, I told you, we met at the Tri-State Motorboat Rally. What was she wearing? I, I don't remember. What did she say to you? I don't remember. Did you steal this girl's number? All right, we didn't meet at some fancy boating event. I didn't even meet her. I met her grandmother. We both tied for first at an amateur level boggling contest. You gotta be kidding me! Look, we're here for you. Do you understand that? But we can't do our job unless you give us your full cooperation. A moment ago, I took a chance and sent her a picture of my cat lying around all funny. You are a carrot. Look, we all have families we want to go home and see. I've got two of them. But we gotta put ourselves aside for one godforsaken second and help this kid out. He hasn't seen any action since Freaky Friday came out on DVD. We gotta saddle up and get back on that pony and ride in that Memorial Day parade. Who's with me, pilgrims? What do I do? I think we gotta do something before that car goes to voicemail. Don't answer it. Make her think we're busier than we are. Do that and she'll think we've been poop texting this whole time. Uh Oh, gee. Everything we've done is for nothing. My wife was right. We should have taken that job as a cat tester while I had the chance. Hello? This is? Yeah. Yeah. I I'm sorry. It was Gwen. We know. Her grandma died. And she wants this team carrot to come over and cuddle them <laughs> <through his way. laughs> Let's get this party started! <laughs> 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 they make it too hot!